We are growing at The Grove. Our vision is to be a growing church for growing people whom Christ will use in growing his kingdom. Don't forget your Partner of the Month nominations due every fourth Sunday. Midweek Manna is back. Join us this Wednesday, September the 4th, for a fresh word from God. We have two opportunities that are designed with you in mind. Try option one. Stop in at our noonday Bible study at 12 noon, which is geared to working and retired adults. Take your lunch break with us and pick up a meal on the way out. It's only one hour. Or try option two. Join us for evening Bible study. Our community meal begins at 6 p.m. A free small meal for all who need it. Then stay for worship and word at 7 p.m. The evening Bible study features classes for children, youth, and adults. Growing people must eat regularly. See you at Midweek Matter. Attention all senior citizens, December the 1st is the last day to sign up for the Christmas luncheon. The luncheon will be held at Farmer's Restaurant and Buffet located in Murfreesboro, Tennessee on December the 14th at 10.45 a.m. For more information, see Sister Carolyn Butler or Reverend Smithson today following service. The Willing Workers Ministry will host a breakfast with Jesus on December the 14th at 9 a.m. in the Fellowship Hall. There will be face painting, gifts, music, breakfast, fellowship, and more. Parents and guardians with kids 0 to 12 years of age are welcome. To sign up, see Reverend Margaret Smithson today following service. The Sunday School Ministry will be collecting Christmas socks and slippers for local nursing homes. Donations are being accepted now through December the 8th. Join us for the Christmas Spectacular, a winter wonderland, on Sunday, December the 22nd, immediately following 1045 a.m. worship service. Dinner will be served following the play. If you are interested in participating in the play, please contact Sharon Lewis or Reverend Tammy Lark today following service. The Christian Education Ministry has teaching opportunities available. Applications are also being accepted for Director of Sunday School. Please see Reverend Tammy Lark for a list of qualifications and applications. The Angel Tree team is taking applicants for the Angel Tree gifts from now till November the 17th. Sign up for your blessing at the Angel Tree Ministry table after service. Join us on December the 29th for our Fifth Sunday service, New Partners Sunday. All new partners will serve during the worship service on this day. All new partners who joined in the year of 2013 are welcome to sing in the choir or serve as ushers and greeters. Join us in the fellowship hall immediately following service for the Grove Ministry Fair. Meet ministry leaders, ask questions, and learn more about all of the ministries at the Grove. Watch Night 2013. Meet us at The Grove on December the 31st for one of our two Watch Night services. We will be bringing in the new year at both of our 7 p.m. or 10.30 p.m. services. We also will have Children's Church at 10.30, as well as encouraging everyone to bring a non-perishable food item to replenish our food bank. See you there, Watch Night 2013. What up, Young Adult Ministry of Watson Grove? This is the Young Adult Sunday School class and we're taking it to a whole new level. We're leaving the church four walls and we're going out to local cafes near you. December 22nd is the date, meet us there. Join us every fourth Sunday of each month. We're not just a regular Sunday School class, we're the next generation of leaders. Greetings to the Grove. Our vision at the Grove is to be a growing church for growing people whom Christ will use in growing his kingdom. We seek to live out that vision through the embodiment of seven core values. God-centric, relationship, outreach, word of God, integrity, nurturing, and generosity. All of these values are expressions of what it means to be a kingdom citizen. However, kingdom citizens must live in a carnal culture that is saturated with the presence of darkness. That sinful influence wants to make the kingdom look more like the world instead of the world being transformed by the kingdom. So how do we consistently let our light shine in a dark world that wants our lights to burn out? 
How do we confront the outside attacks from our culture without being changed? I believe the answer is actually found in our vision. We must keep growing. In November and December, I'll be sharing a series called Confronting the Culture. In this series, we will examine how living out these core values give us power to not only confront culture, but also to change it. You are a kingdom citizen. You don't chase environments, you change environments. Let's find out how. See you in the sanctuary. Stay connected to us by following us on Twitter, liking us on Facebook, texting The Grove, no space, to 55469, or for more information about our announcements or church, check out our website, www.watsongrovembc.org.